This is where all the questions will come in, and okay. this is us. So it'll give them in about 10 seconds, but look who we've got, everyone! Oh, we're already live. Yep, already oh, live. Hi. We're constantly live. Hi! Guys, where's the love? Oh, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> when's Claudia coming? Right now. Hi, hi guys. How did your first rehearsal go? Great, I loved it. Um, uh, it was really good because we didn't have a lot to change and uh, it was amazing. Everything I've ever expected in all these years. Thank you, thank you. I am also so happy to be here. Very happy to be here. Do you like cheese? Yeah, I love cheese. What's your favorite? You are so beautiful. How are you? Thank you. I'm great. I'm so happy to be here. Sometimes I have to pinch myself. I'm still not believing I am actually doing this. Hi, Sadie. With your family being here? Yes, yes, they're coming next week. I miss my dog. I miss my dog, Leila. But we, we, we Skype. Because um, uh, a friend of mine is dog sitting, and uh, every every evening I, I call her and oh yeah I she's like you. a baby. Yeah, of course. <laughs> I'm obsessed a little furry with her. Baby. I'm obsessed with her. What do you do? What do you? What's your favorite tree, guys? You love that one. Favorite tree? Yeah. As in tree? As in yeah, big tree with leaves or. Ah. Uh, it's their favorite question to ask people on the stream. Oh well, I didn't. I've never thought about that. I don't know. Fine, fine to you. Same as y Yoki from Hungary. Yeah. He's got 40, 52 pine trees in his but house. But we have a lot of those in Malta, so that's the first thing that came to my mm. mind. Happy to say thank you. Who do you dedicate the song to? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna keep that as a secret. No, but in general, um, uh, when I sing, I think of all the things I went through, especially to be here on the stage, and it gives me so much emotion and, and so much um, excitement to sing recklessly, and it just comes out, and, and I love doing it. I, I really love this song. Ooh, tell us about your stage outfit. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. Thank you. Okay, so um, uh, we decided we wanted something classy and um, uh, something pure as in color. Uh, we do have a second uh, outfit for tomorrow's rehearsal. Mm -hmm. Oh no, not tomorrow. I lost Thursday? Uh, no, no, Friday. 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 Yeah. What lost... day even is it anyway? <laughs> I know. Oh. Uh, I lost track of time since I've been here. And uh, so we're gonna decide um, after we see how it looks visually. Uh, we're gonna decide which one to choose. And, uh, and then we'll see from there. They're quite very similar. There's just a few changes from one to the other. Yes, uh, which one do I... Whichever one you want to... You, you can answer whatever question. You don't feel the need to answer What's all of them. What's your favourite Maltese entry? Um, uh, of all time, I would say More Than Love from uh, Christian Moira. And that was, I think, in 94. Like that. They'll, these time. guys are encyclopedias. They'll be able to. They'll, uh, they'll yeah, yeah. I hope seconds. I got it right. 1994. Yes. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> Apart from what else are you planning to do in Kiev? Well, tomorrow we have a bus tour, so I'm looking forward to go around and see some of the city because I didn't have time to do that uh, so far. So, uh, and I love traveling. It's my next hobby after after music, and uh, it's good to be able to do both at the same time, like I'm doing at the moment. So then we'll see tomorrow. So is that a special ring on your finger? Yes, my boyfriend gave me this. It's beautiful, guys. For Christmas. How do you like the Eurovision experience so far? I love it. I love it. Um, uh, well, I knew I was going to enjoy it. Of course, um, uh, Fabrizio was able to give me a lot of advice, and um, uh, and I, I just knew. I just didn't know it was going to be so fun. 
because I was never backstage. I was always at, in the audience cheering for him. But this is really cool. I love it. I love it here. How do you feel that people are so touched by your song? I think it's uh, it's a special feeling because this song touches my soul every time. Even during rehearsals, I've sang it so many times, um, even back in, in Malta. And every time I go on stage and sing the song, even while I was at the hotel and we were seeing the yesterday's rehearsal, I get emotional. And I've always wanted to be an artist who transmits um, emotions and, and someone who, that people can relate to. So when I see it happening, it's a dream come true. I think you'll all agree it definitely does happen. We're all left, like we were watching it yesterday and it was just so classy and so beautiful. It was, you know, everything we all expected and, and more, I guess. It was just, it was stunning. You guys, you guys will love it when you actually get to see it. Yes. Can you teach us a word in Maltese? <laughs> Uh, Kifinti means how are you, or Saha, um, which means hi, or bye. Did your brother really cry as you left for your vision? Yes, he got emotional because he cannot be here this year with me, and uh, we are very, very close, and he knows how much I've been working for this, so uh, yeah, he was... Uh, very very emotional about it but um, at the same time he really trusts me you know he's uh, like uh, he knows I can handle it and he knows I will really really enjoy this experience and that's exactly what he told me just cherish it because I have to carry this experience for all my life like he did with his so um, so yeah that's what I'm doing you guys need to come back and do it together you know, everyone is telling me that. I think you guys, it'll. You <laughs> I know, think it would be it. really yeah. cute. No, it'll be beautiful. And Claudia, and actually, there's another. We have another sister, a younger sister. She has a there good go. voice as well. Nice. This is. And I've been trying to brainwash her to go in the festival, but she's a bit shy. She's so gonna see this and be so inspired, though. She'll, I hope she'll so. Go. She will be here next week. <laughs> yeah. And she's even more excited than Fabrizio. So, um, well, she had both of us, you know, it's a lot of things going so on. So is there lots of singing in the house? <laughs> yes, you know, my mom, on. my mom. Oh. It's just my dad that he cannot do it. It's like, he's really bad. <laughs> Completely out of tune. How are you so talented in Mars? You're such a small island, but you seriously have great voices. Yes, I was just mm. talking to someone else before I came here, and that's what we were saying. It's um, it's incredible for us. A lot of us are musicians or um, singers, and uh, we take music so so seriously. And um, and yeah, I think it's just and, and and it comes very natural because we don't really have a we cannot be professionals because we're so small and even we don't actually have a music market but um, I think we're just blessed to have it Absolutely. have it naturally I and you know even the, even the kids have great voices in yes, Malta I, mean, I was in, in Malta for junior Eurovision yeah, last yeah, year exactly. and you know Every, it's like everyone can sing in that country. I know, it's, I mean, if you go and see uh, Destiny, Christina, yeah. um, Gaia, and, Federica, you know, You'll oh end up God. seeing all of them in the big Eurovision one day too. It's yeah, just definitely. this constant cycle. Definitely, it's beautiful. Definitely. Well, with that, what a great lead-in. Do you think Gaia should do Eurovision? Well, yeah, if she wishes to. She's great. I mean, even, even the other girls I mentioned are... are absolutely awesome and uh, why not I mean now they've they're, they're already experienced for such a young age definitely so why not try the other one would you try to visit in your vision in the future I don't know I'm still I'm still overwhelmed let's, by the fact yeah, that I'm here let's get through the first one <laughs> yeah. before we start thinking about that yes I mean Claudia I always love your makeup are you doing that yourself any tips well, today, no. Um, I, while I'm in Kiev, I have, uh, of course, my makeup artist, who is absolutely great. Um, uh, my suggestion, any tips? I think... Uh, 
the most important thing is to know what suits you and uh, what suits your your features and of course the occasion I love makeup um, uh, actually now I've toned it down a bit when I was a teenager I used to love it I used to like it more heavy I think it's a phase a lot of girls go through it is yeah but now uh, but, but what you guys can't see there is there's just a really nice little sort of subtle glitter it's just yeah. everywhere you, on the on her eyes it's beautiful because we were we were rehearsing in the, in the hotel today earlier on before I came here we were rehearsing the second outfit for Friday oh, yeah, yeah. yeah so we, we did a bit of makeup as well um, similar to what I would have um, uh, on stage if anything calls for glitter it's Eurovision yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like my dress all glitter oh, yeah. <laughs> Federica Falzon should come in Eurovision and win. She can do it. Federica is another great voice. I mean, you look at her, she's this size, she opens her mouth and whoa, that voice comes comes out. I don't know where she, when I see her, I, I that's what exactly what I tell her, where do you get it from? <laughs> and I mean if you if you consider these girls so young so yeah. it's, it's naturally it, it comes naturally I remember with Destiny um, Destiny spoke, is yeah, another legend we Michael. spoke in Bulgaria and I asked her how long she'd been singing and she said oh one year and I was just yes I, one but, year but you have you have to understand that this is most of the the Maltese artists have never really professionally trained Really? Yeah, I, myself, for instance, I've never actually trained the technique or, or anything of the sort. It's just natural uh, talent. It's an island of natural talent. Yeah. yeah. Maybe. Ah, yeah. oh, now it's all making sense. You're all every, everyone who's born on the island gets that those genes, the singing genes, and then comes to your vision and rocks it. Yes. What is your favorite TV show? Um, okay, let's see. I actually like Game of Thrones. <gasps> yeah. I and it was shot in Malta as well. Yes, yes, the first the season. The first season was yes, shot in Malta I love Game the King's Landing. Yeah, I love Game of Thrones. I haven't watched, I don't know if it started, if the season is on again now. I don't know, I'm not sure about that. How do the last minutes five plus minutes feel before going on stage? What are your last thoughts? I talk to myself before going on stage and even while I'm on stage I talk to myself. I just encourage myself um, um, by reminding myself what a long journey it has been and how beautiful it has been with, it, with it, its ups and downs and uh, that this is just three minutes and I have to cherish these three minutes because when you think about it you know you you work for it so hard and those three minutes is that three minutes in life are nothing but in this case it could be everything yeah exactly. absolutely so uh, and you guys remember before Ralph Siegel told us that there's so much work behind those three minutes that you guys might not see but these guys live and do for the whole like six months a year all of that time before this that you know uh, yeah. it can't, it, we get to that point and it's just like a polished little three minutes it's true it's true and it, and, and you, you know when it all goes bright you just never you don't see the hard work that's there I'm gonna give you this <gasps> A little present. Thank you so much. How do you like the the feathery? Uh, what are you wearing underneath that? Sorry, that's probably an inappropriate <laughs> question to ask. Flesh. Oh. <laughs> yep, that one's going up on the wall. Beautiful. Thank you so much. You're welcome. All right, guys. Do you want to do uh, final goodbyes and send all the love you can to Malta? What makes you breathless? Being on stage, especially this stage. Yeah. There's always a little drop just before they start rolling in with the goodbye. We love you. Thank you so much. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh. Thank you. This is awesome. Feel free to come back anytime you want. Hafna Hafna Beus. Bye. Thank you so, so much. Thank you.